I'm Tatiana Knight, professional organizer. What's the most chaotic room in the house? Most people would say it's the kitchen, but I'd say it's the bathroom where the real gridlock happens. Let me show you. We're in the bathroom and what's the problem? A lack of storage space. What's the solution? Using up space that was previously ignored before. So I've gone with my Trinity slat shelving because it looks great. It doesn't take up that much real estate, but it really does the job. Down low, I have a really deep canvas organizer from Trinity. So all my extra toilet paper is right here, ready to go when they need it. Another thing I like to do is to categorize the items. I've taken these canvas baskets from Trinity and I've put a specific category of items into every single one. So as you can see, this is my brush basket and this is my washcloth basket. And another way of categorizing is by members of your family. So this could be for mom, this could be for dad, this could be for Sally. Everybody has their own holders and everybody knows where to put their stuff away when they're done. I am always amazed by the huge pile of products that I find under the sink at my clients' homes. I've solved the problem using Trinity's under sink organizer. First of all, it goes all the way up to the top with two levels, so none of the space is wasted. Also, it's specifically made to go around the plumbing under this sink, so it's not gonna bump or slam into anything when I pull it out. So my tip is to categorize items, throw out anything that you don't need or you're not gonna use, and then keep things in sections so that when you need something, you know exactly where to get it. It's also gonna save me some time and money because I'm gonna reduce all the extra shopping when I'm losing items in the back. The bathroom may be the smallest place in the home, but it's no longer the messiest thanks to Trinity. Happy organizing! For more creative storage ideas, visit trinityii.com. You can visit these websites to learn more about the participants on this edition of Designing Spaces.